different speaker on. Hopefully the wind noise might be a little bit better. Um, obviously, as Cassie says, I'm still a terrible YouTuber. I forgot to hit record when we were pulling out the dock, but that's all right. Y'all didn't miss nothing. It was very uneventful for a change. It was nice. So we just got the head sail up now. We're heading down towards Pensacola Beach somewhere. Um, gonna anchor out, grill us some pineapple barbecue cheeseburgers, drink a few beers. We're gonna catch some fish. We're catching damn fish today. I don't care, whatever it is, we're gonna eat it too. I don't care if it's a fucking baby catfish. We're gonna catch it, we're gonna damn eat it. Unless it's not a legal size, then we'll let it go. So. It's actually really windy out here. Maybe that's why he was saying that. Don't be scared of the wind. <laughs> Idea what that sound was. It sounded like silverware. It's coming from inside the boat. So. I think it's silverware. Silverware ain't moving. It's <laughs> uh... We got wind chimes in there? Oh, it's the keys? Oh. Wind chimes. Or wave chimes? Yeah. Well, first mystery solved for the day. Cruising about four knots. Just a tiny, tiny bit of head sail out. I don't know, not tiny. I guess it'd be like a working jib size. So about half of our big ass Genoa because we have a huge Genoa on this boat, which is awesome. So it sails awesome in light winds. But whoever did this sail did really good because even when you got about half rolled up, it's still got a really, really good sh uh, sail shape. So when we get a new one, we're going to take this one off and say we want this exact sail. So here we go, it's turning a little bit. Okay, waves are getting pretty big. This little autopilot's. We're turning a little bit. There we go. This little autopilot's working its ass off, but it's keeping us pretty damn straight. I'm like really impressed. Cause it's actually pretty damn decent sized waves out here right now. Yeah, Seas? Two, three feet. Yeah, an easy two, three feet. Every now and then we'll get some that are bigger and those are the ones that push the boat sideways cause they're hitting us kind of right on the side. But hit the front. yeah, to hit the front and kind of push us around, but that's expected. But yeah, I needed this autopilot in my life. Because this one gets mad at me sometimes. All the time. All the time. But I don't know how the sound is with this new speaker. It's just a medium out on the GoPro. Um, I have no idea how to work it. It said you could select speakers from the front and the back. So it might be on the back speaker and you might not even be able to hear me right now. Oh, she just got wet. That was a big one. It wasn't that bad. It's all over there. That is another thing we have to do. They took off the, I think you call them comings, the pieces of wood I'm that go right there. Splashboards. So she's gonna call them splashboards, which would make sense to call them splashboards. I don't know where comings came from, but I don't know where half these sailors' words came from. But that's gonna be our next bigger project. Is we got to get those on because whenever we even get small waves over the side, it just comes right in the cockpit. And next thing you know, we got wet asses. Which is okay if it's 100 degrees outside, but when it's 40 degrees outside, it's not too fun. But a little tiller. I'm sorry, guys. I'm gonna say this probably a hundred times today. There you go. I love this thing. Holy shit! We're still, We're still going straight. That wave just pushed us over, though. Pretty damn far. I got my you nose is, boogers. My nose is running. <laughs> I think every time I put the camera on you, your nose is fucking running. It's always running. <laughs> You're like, <laughs> every I swear time. I'm not a cokehead. Obviously. <laughs> well, we anchored out over here on Pensacola Beach area. Doing a little bit of fishing. We about to grill up some burgers. Caught a little catfish already, so changing the way we're fishing. I don't want to sit here and catch catfish all day. 
We were going to video it, but I was just like, eh, hey, it's a little catfish. Nobody wants to see a little catfish. Now, if we don't catch nothing else today, I'll wish I would have got video of that fucking stupid catfish. He wanted to keep it. I wanted to keep it. It wasn't a sail cat, though. Sail cats are good. Yeah, they're like fucking three feet, four feet long. Well, the biggest one we caught was 28 inches. 28 inches. We got a big old fillet off that damn thing, too. So, so yeah, later this summer, once they get the Three Mile Bridge fixed up, we'll go up there to the bay and do some sail cat fishing again. Those things are good. You fry them up with some hush puppies and some french fries. Mm. Try shark. And yeah, we catch all kinds of little sharks up there too. So maybe we'll try some shark this year. Everybody tells me you gotta kill them like instantly though because they pee through their skin. I don't know, I just feel bad killing fish. So I make her kill everything. And yes, I still make her take my fish off when I catch one because that's how manly I am. So just so y'all know. Well, we've been anchored out here a couple hours now. Conditions have con definitely changed which is nice it's been really calm winds kind of died down so it might be a long sail back but water is as smooth as can be sun just beating down and we about to have pineapple cheddar barbecue burgers mm. Yeah. You want it on the bun? Or on I don't care. Are you putting it on the bun? Yeah, the burger. That's not. That's not. That's that's the bun. Fuck. You sure, that's barbecue sauce. It looks like ketchup. <laughs> yes, sir. That is Heinz Memphis sweet and spicy barbecue sauce. This is not a paid promotion. But it's a squeeze bottle. That's what I bought it. <laughs> Just want to say thank you to our buddy David Owens for the awesome <laughs> idea for pineapple barbecue burgers. And then Cassie for buying everything. Yeah, but she's a badass. I forgot the name of that place where I ate the pineapple burger. I don't know. Shores. Okay, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Is that the bottom I see? What? Of the fucking I, I don't know. Ground? I, it's hard to tell. I think it is. Uh, uh, yeah. I thought it was off. Yep, there's our, our big catfish. This is our third one today. But he really yanked on it like we had something. He yanked it out of the holder. Yeah, he did. All right, well, she's got to put it here. I'll hold the camera while she unhooks our fish. <laughs> Damn pole shit. What are you doing? You gotta reel it in a little bit I more. I can do that. Here. Are you sure? Yeah. We're, we're like master GoPros here. I doubt that. As long as I don't drop it in the water. Come on, buddy. All right, let's see if I can do this. You ready? So y'all thought I was joking. I don't fuck with no fish. I'll catch them all day long. You don't have to touch it. Come on, buddy. Let go of it, you little shit. Oh, there you are. Good job, Miss Cassie. Well, I love our little grill. It's convenient. But I don't know what to do. It's really uneven on temps. It's like one side cooks really hot, the other side cooks really cold. I don't know what to say. And then all the grease, I don't know if y'all can see that, it's so beautiful. All the grease just drips down onto the damn propane bottle. Maybe it's because we have the way we have to have it turned. I don't know, it's disgusting. I said it's convenient, but it's just such a pain in the ass to use. So comment, tell me what y'all do. Does y'all shit do that? Get all greasy and drip all down and cook even? Maybe I got a defective magma grill? I don't know. Y'all tell me? Well, we were just double hooked. Cassie had a catfish on her line. And I think she's got another one on her line because oh her pole's God. down. Don't lose my damn pole. Just chill down here while you're doing that. No, no, we're good. All right, never mind. It's just the last fish pulled it loose. All right, and we got a... Uh, Got that catfish off, something took off on our line. We got a little stingray. We've never caught a stingray. I have no idea how to get it unhooked. Same as you do else, I So I'm gonna get her the <laughs> really? polars, get the beer out the way. All right, we're about to trade because she's. You wiener. I ain't getting stung. I just need my knee pain. We got a long thing. So hopefully we didn't kill the stingray. He He's not fighting. Oh, he's good. Uh. 
Yeah. All right, you got him? And that little shit. Mm. Oh almost unhooked. Almost. Oh, oh, we still got our bait. Those little fuckers are heavy. You could tell he fought like a bitch. Very heavy. Interesting. Well, guys, we caught our first stingray. Cassie did a good job. She just wants to drink her beer, so I'm not going to throw my line out no more. Cause she gets mad. Cause we won't catch nothing until she's just ready to drink a beer. So, all right, well, there we go. Caught a stingray, a few catfish. Four catfish. It was kind of cool. Two fish on at one time. I mean, I, this is, yeah, stingray's a fish. Yeah, it's a type of shark. So, I don't know what kind of stingray that was. It was just a little stingray. It was one of them gray ones. One of them gray, gray little baby things. I don't know. Basic ass stingray. Yeah, basic, basic bitch. And you pet. Yeah, you pet him? At the zoo. Why didn't you pet that one? Why were you so scared then? I was scared he was gonna whack me with his tail. Yeah, he looked like he was gonna whack you with his tail. I don't wanna get whacked with anybody's tail. <laughs> she don't wanna get whacked by a tail. She's not about that bad. Sail him back. Three o'clock. We should be back to the marina in time to watch the sunset. Drink another beer, and then head home. Trying to steal my son. Oh. Oh, don't fall. It got to be a beautiful day as we hoped it would. Where are we going out on? The Boshan. The Boshan. We're going out on the Boshan. Thanks to Lala. Love we love Love It. Get it? Haha. <laughs> had a dog named Love It. <laughs> then we changed her name to Buffy. Buffy? Vampire Slayer? Just Buffy. Just Buffy. Just yeah, that'd be a lot cooler if it was vampire slime. A few boats out today though. I guess the weather was good enough. We got some people out here, not just fishers. Fishermen, fishers. We got, we got just regular fishers. I don't even know. She's drunk. She's not drunk. Good weather out here today. It was a little windy this morning, a little chilly, but God, it turned out to be a nice day.